Now in this particular video, we are going to look at to how to solve problem number three and which is this compare the triplets. So let's try to solve this problem. Now before I attempt and before I explain the problem, I will suggest all of you to uh, go through the hacker rank platform and try to solve this problem on your end and you can pause the video till that point. Once you are done, you can look at the video to solve the problem. So let me explain the problem. So there are two friends, Alice and Bob, each created one problem uh, for hacker rank. A reviewer rated two problems awarding point on a scale from 1 to 100 for three categories, problem clarity, originality and the difficulty. So the rating of for Alice is the triplet A0, A1, A and A2. So this is the rating for Alice and B is the rating for Bob. Now the task is to find the comparison point by comparing A, A0 with B0, A1 with V1. So basically you need to compare this element with this element, this element with this element and this element with this element. Now these are the rules that are uh, that are given and according to which you need to award the point. So if Alice's score is greater than the Bob score, then Alice will get get one point. Is if Alice's score is less than Bob's score, then Bob will get one point. And if both the scores are same, then none of none of both the, none of them none of them will get any point. So it is zero. Now there is example. So if A is this, B is this, then the total score is so total score for Alice is one because one is greater than th uh, sorry three is greater than one and over here three is greater than one so here Alice is, is having so if you compare this particular term one and three Bob will get one point if you compare this term and this term no one will get any point if you get, compare this term with this term Alice is getting one point so total score for Alice is one total score for Bob is one now this particularly means that the return output that will be that will be ne needed to be returned will be having one and one so both are going to have the same score and if you look at the format this is what we need to return so we have these as the input and we need to return the output in this format so let's try to solve this question again i can first of all choose python 3 and you can see again we need to just complete the function a and b will be the given given list so you can you can look a is a list and b is also a list and we just need to com complete this function so let's complete this function so let's write the logic number one so uh, for i in range so we will run a for loop that will go through each element or that can help me to go through each element of the of the list from a and b so for i in range uh, length of a because both the list are going to have the same length we will run this particular for loop for the length of a or maybe you can run it for length of b also so the length of b let's say if it is 3 so my for loop is going to run for three times now i will write if uh, a of i is greater than b of i so if ls score is greater than bob score and i am comparing the first score so if for the first time like when my loop is running for the first time i will be 0 and i am comparing a of 0 with b of 0 so if ls score is greater than bob score let me create a let me create a variable ls with value as 0 and bob is my variable with value as 0 so ls is going to get point so i'll say ls is equal to ls plus 1 or even i can write the same thing as ls plus is equal to 1 similarly lf so else if ls score is less than bob score then 
bob is going to get some point which is equal to 1 and else the last thing so else if both score is same so else you can write and else if so you don't need to even write this else function like you don't need to write uh, you don't need to uh, mention the last condition because if this is not happening and if this is not happening then definitely both are the same right so you don't need to mention the last statement we can just say that pass so pass is a keyword that will pass the loop if both the statements are uh, if both uh, if both the elements are same so i'm just saying that pass the loop because i don't want it to give, provide any point either to ls or to bob so i'm just saying pass and after this i will be required to return the score for or the total score for ls followed by bob so ls comma bob okay so let's try to run it so we are able to complete the sample test case 0 and 1 and let's try to submit the code and we were able to uh, solve all the test cases so you can see all the test cases are passed and we can now move to the next challenge so we will look into the next challenge in the next video